you ever told me that someone had turned Super Mario Brothers into a first person shooter, well, I'd have a little bit of trouble trying to imagine what that'd look like. Well, imagine no more because a guy named Sean Noonan has done just that with what he's calling the Super 1-1 challenge. Nani? This is a single level recreation of a Super Mario Brothers level made with the Unreal 4 engine. And if I may say so, it's one that looks mighty faithful and pretty much like it could be official Nintendo content. Which kind of leads me to wonder if Nintendo are going to swoop down on this video with some kind of copyright strike or a cease and desist notice. Or I don't know, maybe a bunch of cops will show up at my apartment and smash the door down or something. Imagine that. <laughs> Gameplay wise, this works surprisingly well and controls really smoothly. You control our favourite height challenged plumber Mario, running around and shooting perfectly modelled Goombas with a plunger gun. Breaking bricks, shooting crates for mushrooms and superstars, collecting gold and red coins before ending the level by jumping onto a flagpole. Hey, if it ain't broke, don't fix it. Just like in the other games, you've got a ground slam move too, which you activate by pressing control when in the air. And there's even an underground area you access by crouching on top of a pipe, so it really is a pretty accurate adaptation of the platformers into a first person perspective. And you know what? It's super addictive. So much so that I played this thing about a dozen times now. Every time I got bored today, I just kept loading it up and just blasting through it. Like I said, it controls super smoothly. It looks and sounds great, and it's just really polished. Again, showing what's possible when dev tools are put into the hands of capable and talented individuals. Now, according to Sean, this was mostly done as some kind of level-making project and for him to come to grips with learning more about mapping and game design. So, don't expect this to get developed any further. What you're looking at is all you're getting, bitch. The whole thing lasts maybe 10 or so minutes for a first-time playthrough and even less once you know where you're going. I think my fastest time clocked in at about 3 minutes. So the whole thing's short and sweet, like Mila Kunis. At the moment, he hasn't even made this thing public, I'm just a very spoiled asshole who gets to play things early because my life is dope and I do dope shit. Nani? But when it is released, I'll make sure to put a download link in the comments and the video description below. Anyway, I'll stop talking out of my asshole now and just let you guys watch one of my playthroughs. You can also follow Sean on Twitter or join his Discord. Enjoy the video. Okie dokie! <laughs>
Thank you so much for playing my game.